This unique European car may hold the solution to reducing harmful car exhaust emissions. Made largely of plastics, the car will make its international debut racing in this year's World Solar Challenge in Australia in November. The solar-powered car, called Nuna, has been designed and built by a group of Dutch students. With support from the European Space Agency and the Association of Plastics Manufacturers in Europe, Nuna brings cutting-edge space technology down to Earth. We are using plastics in space very often, mainly to reduce the weight of our satellites and our space capsules of our space machines in general. This is due to the fact that every kilogram launched into orbit costs us about 30,000 euros per kilogram. And therefore we have to have come up with lightweight solutions and their plastics play a big role. Over 30% of the car is made from plastics, including its solar cells, batteries, tyres and motor. And, uh, Throughout the race, uh, Nuna will be powered by state-of-the-art uh, solar cells, originally developed for use in satellites. Its telecommunication equipment is powered by a small strip of solar cells, originally used on the Hubble Space transfer. Telescope. And there's more space technology inside Nuna. Its batteries and energy management systems were originally developed for use on board satellites and donated by the European Space Agency as part of its technology transfer program. Three, Advanced plastics two, moulding techniques one. developed for use on space shuttles have been used on Nuna's carbon fibre reinforced plastics body. The resulting aerodynamics and low drag factor have allowed the car to reach speeds of up to 160 kilometres an hour. We have uh, many parts of the car which makes from plastic. Um, the outer shell and the upper shell are made from plastic. Uh, then we have, of course, the tires. Um, it's a special compound which is used in the tires for a very low rolling resistance. And that we need, of course, for solar rays to get as fast as possible. And the solar cells are laminated in, in a very special uh, new product type plastic. As it races across Australia, Luna will demonstrate sustainable technologies which could soon be seen in vehicles across Europe. Plastics are being used more and more due to their unique properties. Because plastics are lightweight, they will enable cars to be lightweight, therefore consuming less fuel, therefore also extending the life of fossil reserves, and also as a result, the CO2 emissions in the atmosphere will be less. As Nuna competes under demanding conditions of heat and distance, it will drive home a serious message that plastics used to meet the demands of space could also play a vital role in protecting the Earth's environment.